Hello, my name is Jiaxin. I have just completed my undergraduate degree in information technology at UTS. I want to apply for the position of IT support energy. Through studying in UTS, I have mastered a lot of technical knowledge. For example, installing and configuring computer software and hardware. I also have some experience deploying applications using Microsoft Azure. In the group work, we were asked to use Azure for the continued integration and continued delivery. My major is Enterprise System Development, so I can also use Java and C++ to write applications. The reason why I applied for this job is that I want to practice what I have learned in school through this job. In my opinion, if I want to fully master the knowledge, I need to combine theory with practice. I'm also happy to use my professional knowledge to help others, which will give me a great sense of achievement. If I get a job, I can start working right away. My school holiday is from now until the mid-February next year. I can work full-time during this period. When I go back to school, I can do a part-time job. First of all, I have a bachelor degree in IT and plan to study for a master degree. It is not difficult for IT students to solve computer software and hardware problems. I can do this job well. In school, I use Microsoft Zone. Therefore, cross service will be easier for me to start. Secondly, I have industry experience in software development, so I can judge and solve the problem more quickly when facing software problems. I have strong hands-on skill. I once made a small speaker by myself. In addition, during my internship, I often discuss project design with the client. I can communicate well with the client. Thirdly, I worked as a cashier in a supermarket. I have ex experience in customer service. I believe I can serve customers well for the, this IT support energy. Fourthly, I can work well with the team member. At school, we use Microsoft Teams and Google Workspace. I'm familiar with the software for teamwork. Fifthly, I'm currently living in Glib and it only takes me 30 minutes to go to CVD so I can quickly respond to the company needs. I had an assignment for a class that required us to make a library boring system. Towards the end of the project, we ran into a problem. When someone came in to check out a book, we add some random data to our database for no reason, but none of our team members knew what caused it. I ask each team member to check what they were they responsible for, and then cross-check what the other team member was responsible for. According to the phenomenon of the fault, it infers that there's a problem in our data entry part, but we still don't know what caused the glitch. I sent an email to the teacher asking about this problem, but mm, the teacher also suggests to recheck the code. Um, after discussing with my team member, I finally de decided to seek the help of my seniors. I think upclassmen may have faced similar problems before. Soon, the upclassmen help us find the problem and we wrote one last piece of code. Finally, we made up all the code and the problem was solved. This seemed to be a small problem, but for us who was came, in, came into contact with this project for a long time.